A man is behind bars after a string of armed USPS robberies in multiple cities. Officers are currently looking for a second man involved. So this all started in James City County Thursday afternoon and ended in Virginia Beach with multiple law enforcement agencies involved. Sarah Hammond has the details on why one man is concerned these robberies are getting more frequent. James City County police officers responded to multiple armed robbery calls involving United States Postal Service delivery drivers on Thursday. The first happened around 1 o'clock on Coleman Drive and again at 2 on Steeplechase Way. Close to an hour later, they say the same suspect robbed another USPS driver in Hampton. Detectives with Hampton police found the car used was a rental issued to 20-year-old Chance Pugh. Detectives in Virginia Beach spotted the suspect and vehicle at an apartment complex and found 19 year old Deshaun Evans McLeod. He was taken into custody and later charged with robbery and use of a firearm in commission of a felony, among other charges. Officers are still looking for Pew. Every day, a criminal sticks a gun in a letter carrier's face and robs them. Frank Albergo is the national president of the Postal Police Officers Association. They're the law enforcement arm of USPS. He says in the last three years, their power to protect postal workers has been severely cut down by federal legislators. The postal police are confined to physical post offices instead of out on the roads with delivery drivers. They're no longer protecting mail and we're no longer protecting letter carriers who have increasingly become targets of criminals. Albergo says these criminals are going after master keys to the USPS collection boxes and checks. This is sad to say as a postal police officer, but the Postal Service has been exposed as an easy target. And he wants to see his officer's jurisdictional authority reinstated to cut down on crimes like this. Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now.